Welcome back to Dr. Schneider Plays XCOM 2. And also, I forgot to turn my laptop down, so there's going to be a weird echo in the VOD. Alrighty then. I'm just going to give everyone a few minutes to show up. And then we'll kick it off. What, what, what kind of mission were we on last time? I forget. Hello. Hello. Apologies for that. It's fine. I was just re responding to messages and, you know. You know. I turned notifications off, but it still popped up on my screen that you joined the party. When, when I tick the box to turn all notifications off, PlayStation needs to understand. That's because I don't want a big ugly box on my stream. So what the hell happened? I, I don't know. I, I was... I've been, like, focusing the game for two days. Well, so have I. And I've barely been on. Anyway, let's, let's pop into our campaign. Yeah, I'll pull up the stream real quick. Well, we were a little bit late because we had to sort some stuff out. Yeah. I probably won't be as talkative as usual either, so just letting you know that in advance. I'm kind of multitasking at the moment. Let me tell you what multitasking. <laughs> I'll pop in and speak when pertinent, though. Oh, also... This is going to be the first... Uh, stream that I'm going to have to edit using Twitch highlights. Really? Well, it turns oh, September yeah. it turns September 20th at the end of the stream. Damn. Well, good luck. Yeah, I eat that shit. Hey, commander. I don't think we have to build anything. Uh, we can. We should build like a mimic beacon. Since they're reusable, you only get to use it once per mission, but comes back after the mission. Okay, now what were we doing? We're doing guerrilla ops. I want to install a radio relay. I want to do guerrilla ops. Wolfbreaker for a scientist. Cursed mother for supplies. Potent prince for intel. Potent prince is a great name, but I really need the scientist. And it also stops my breakthrough. Commander, we'll need to have one of our troops equip the Skulljack for use in All the right. field if we're going to make any progress. We got Shaq Fu, objective. we got me, we got Durf Dallas Roust, and then we have the Kaze fill-in <laughs> until the, the player pool cycles back around. Let's make all items available. Wish I could do this in one button still. Okay, you're still shaking, so you need mind shield. Ragtime needs to heal. So I will take the mimic beacon, since I'll probably be most forward anyway. Excellent, let's go. Doing what's wrong with you. I'm still jealous of PC players that have like instant loading. Even though the full game is installed on the PlayStation, it takes so long.
just uses up the entire commentary for the whole stream on that loading screen. Like, oh my lord. So, protect the device. It's in a diner. Kill all enemies. In a repeat if necessary. This is a great map for Mimic Beacon. I've had it before. I can't remember what kind of mission it was. They might have been able to destroy the beacon mission. Now that I think about it. But this map's pretty good. Great sniping spot. You get squad size upgrade as soon as we have enough power though. Just waiting for my engineers to build that sweet power. Oh, it's a it's like the evening mission too. I've only played this on night map. Hostile forces are already moving to destroy the data tap installed nearby. We need to lock down the area and secure the device at all costs. So I'm actually gonna move the sniper first this time. Location confirmed. To just take advantage of that beautiful sniping spot up there. And perhaps give us line of sight on the enemies. Because we do need to kill all of them to complete the mission. And Durf has to get a kill without getting hit. In addition to everything else. Moving to designated position. Jaunt down here. No bad guys. Taking overwatch. Now Angel Taylor is gonna jaunt over here. So we know there's bad guys over there. Cannot risk a flank. And Shaq's just gonna dash up. Because his legs aren't strong enough to carry him where he needs to go. Their chances are pretty good. Shack over here. On Overwatch. On Overwatch. Let's go for the double tap. And it was just a butte crit instead. I, I loved how the sectoid died though. He just like stood up and then fell over. I love when Shaq gets his first overwatch. Because not only does he demolish him in one hit every time guaranteed, but he also puts holo targeting on him. Just in case he doesn't kill him in one hit guaranteed. And I will just move up in Overwatch because I do not have the perk that keeps me concealed. I figured the shotgun Overwatch wasn't going to be very valuable. I need to ask Shaq if he uh, uses turtle wax on that thing, it's so shiny. Do. Uh, any turn we don't see enemies, we're going to make big moves. We're just going to keep Durf in reserve. Got some here. In case we reveal anyone, we can clean him up. Someone has to get shot here. Do you, do you put it on with a cloth, or with a buffing wheel, though, is the question. I'm on it. Now that we know you're waxing. Try to shoot at the Muton. 
Mutons seem like they got way more annoying in XCOM 2. I mean, am I wrong? I think they're way more dumb. Did you see me drop that guy? I guess. That was a shot that probably didn't deserve to work out. <laughs> he just says yes. He doesn't say whether it's a buffing wheel or a cloth, he just says yes. <laughs> Last shack for you. Cannot get the slash. Whatever you say. So we're gonna move up. There's at least one more group of enemies. On the other side of the diner that are taking shots at the objective. I have the most accurate shotgun ever made, by the way. I don't think I've ever missed a shotgun overwatch. Did you see that one? On the move. Objective position confirmed. Okay, there's a thing we're gonna protect. Protect the gear at all costs, except I don't really want to sacrifice any of my soldiers, if possible. Seems doable. Next turn I'll get that loot. I swear unto thee. Go, go, go. See if we can get a look inside. Get some squad sight for Durf, maybe? Guess not. Um, since you don't have... Squad site overwatch, I'm just gonna reload. Back in. And then pistol overwatch just in case. On the okay, the the stun lancer just underwent mitosis and divided. I can't because it's vanilla. But, if I was playing War of the Chosen, I would definitely have some advanced characters. Well, the thing is, you can't make somebody a Templar or a Paladin. You have to earn the Templar or Paladin. So you can only get, like, faction heroes, basically? Yes and no. I mean, you, can, you have the chance for events to pop up where you can get more of them, but they only guaranteed give you one of each. Don't worry, Shaq. You're safe in my hands. I'm going to dip out for a few minutes after you use the restroom and take care of a couple things. This is going to be kind of a weird stream for me, but I figure since I'm the one not playing. Makes sense. I'll be right back. Yep. So it's probably obvious what I'm trying to do here. I've got the thing. But we'll see. Wow, what a miss. Yeah, I didn't get it. That's a shame. Okay, Durf doesn't have eyes on anything. So you're gonna lose your height advantage. I regret to inform you. Now, check this out. I'm going to toss my beacon over here. All the bad guys are going to shoot at it and probably also run out and expose themselves. As long as I'm getting an amazing crit, they probably won't kill it at 3 damage, even if they all hit. This is what I want to see. Stun Lancers were the biggest threat, and now they're pretty much neutralized.
Now can Shaq get any dirty flanks? Can he ever? Once again, not the best target selection for the holo targeting, but not too bad either. Better odds with Sniper right now. One shot, one kill. Um, I think we'll have line of sight from here. We don't. We have any good hacking rewards to make this turn with it. Um, yeah. So now we get to do our whole turn over again. I'm in. I'm not gonna lie, it was pretty sweet. No need to ask twice. This guy's toast. Because Shaq isn't capable of missing. Target neutralized. Guns dry. Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Flawless victory. I maybe should have set it on a higher difficulty. But I wasn't sure how well I'd perform while well, uh, trying to do commentary as well, which I think the commentary is suffering because I'm focusing more on the game, which is not necessarily a bad thing. Hopefully it's entertaining either way. Should have some wonderful promotions. At least one. We're taking Advent apart one mission at a time. Oh, we got two. Impressive work. Even better. So Shaq's not going to chain shot. Now chain shot's going to combo well with aim and hollow targeting. So, you hunker down, get your aim bonus, take your chain shot, get a hit, it'll apply hollow targeting, and then get your second hit, which should have a minus zero. Because so, hollow targeting gives 15? Yeah. Derf no longer shaken. And now with face off. So you can shoot all the bullets now. Considering the limited resources and a scientist is gonna help so much. Still managed to exceed my expectations. Excellent work. 